Because you'll never take back our country with weakness. You have to show strength and you have to be strong. What I'm trying to get people to understand is when they see a homeless person on the street or in a shelter, what's really at play there is the failure of governments to actually implement their human rights obligations. We're history's actors. Our fellow citizens who are not as rich as us are seen as some kind of social problem to be managed. Our next narcissistic blow as a species. The revolution must be by and for everyone. We're rolling the dice. Tradition, God, nature. You are a traitor, Lindsey Graham. A traitor. Fascism. A true Hobbesian Leviathan. Does a stand-up <laughs> change society? I'm going to say no. Human beings, in contrast to other species, are not fixed in their relations with the environment by biology. In a just society, these things would be taken out of the, the, the market. They've grown out of our infancy. No carrots. Just avoiding sticks. Has anyone tried this yet? They broke the glass in the United States Capitol. Oh, and you're probably a little bit broken. You're coming to the realization that you're going to have to begrudgingly get involved to stop the continued devolution of society. Hey, we're capitalist, and that's just the way it is. Really, this is just a mind equals right, history is written by the victors type of argument. The left today has no interest in organizing the honest. They were violent, they were revolutionaries, and they wanted to destroy our federal government. And so this is a story about how we've got here. And that button simply said on it, fuck off. Right. And they pressed that button. Right. I just want to let you guys know, this is like the <laughs> sacredest place. The promises any of our previous stories have had in offering a cohesive, inclusive project have failed. Hey, wake up.